Hello, welcome to another review. We are doing Feakston Old Peculiar The Legend. Oh, yeah. Gorgeous. I've had this before. Really nice. I'm going to hand it over to Doug now crack to open. crack it open. Sweet, okay. Ah, quick boring cap, actually. <laughs> Just sold it. Mm. No branding. Oh, he's it's bent it. No. No, no snoop. Okay. There's no smoke without fire, apparently. Mm. Who said that? Okay. Wait, is this your glass? Yeah. Make your half even. That's enough. It's lovely. It's lovely. A perfect half, I can Pretty much. Thank you very much. It's quite right. Mm. Got the colour against that background. It's pretty quite dark. dark. Very dark, but nice ruby. You can just see. Shining through. Very nice. A bit, bit of, bit of a head on it. Quite a dark head. Sort of creamy coloured head. Very it nice. Is creamy, isn't it? Yeah. Not much carbonation, however. No. I wouldn't expect it to be honest. It's very dark, isn't it? Yeah. Should it's we um, ruby tint if you look at the bottom? Give it a sniff. Yeah, give it. Check out the aroma. Well, it smells dark. Yes, yeah, sort of roasted hot chocolate. Slightly chocolatey, in a in a way, co chocolate coffee. Smells <laughs> quite creamy. Oh, I've got something in my eye. Go on, dig in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's give it a taste. I don't think that's actually that much in the aroma. I mean, no, it's quite plain. It's, it's nice. It's got. It's, it's sort got of a bit of a roasted yeah, scent to it, but, but other than that, there's nothing. There's not much, no. Dig in. Yeah. Taste. Sort of same again with the taste. Quite plain, but night coffee notes and chocolatey notes. Very dark. Um, Yeah, you really get those roasted monster crust, don't you? Mm. It's nice. It's lovely, yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. What would you give that in? I mean, obviously you've had it a lot of times before, so you probably already know what you're sort of going to give it. Probably a a six or a seven it's not amazing it's not complex is it it's pretty plain but the flavors you do get a, a different uh, you know mm, I think I disagree I mean I'll probably give it at least an eight because I love Fix and stuff you know but yeah you're right it's not a complex taste it's not got much bitterness to it either but no still a nice dark dark beer right so I'm saying Six, seven, Doug's going eight. Yeah, seven or eight. Good beer, definitely worth getting. You know, just something different. But it's good. So we'll leave it at that. See you later for another review, I guess. Say bye. Yeah, see ya.